widespread damage all across Wichita from last night's storm. Cakes Lulu has a look at what caused headaches for motorists today. We're south of 29th and Woodlawn by Galicia Heart Hospital, where they had to use backup generators because of this down power poles and power lines blocking major streets in northeast Wichita. I was thankful it wasn't closer to the house. I was thankful it was just the fence. Some people in northeast Wichita waking up to no electricity and down branches, even damaged property. It was a good uh, shade tree, pear tree. <laughs> Lost uh, about three good sized branches and Looks like I got my work cut out this morning. Gonna have a chainsaw party. <laughs> Down power lines and power poles block busy streets like Woodlawn from Main Skate to K96. I had no idea it was that bad. I thought it was just one until this morning. That's when I saw the rest of it. And a business near 39th and Webb Road had its roof ripped and then mangled around a flagpole. Insulation covered much of this parking lot, but thankfully no one was hurt. Then back near K96 in Hillside, this EMS station is now without a roof, and it's all blamed on strong winds that caused widespread damage. I heard a big crash, and then the hail started hitting, and it, it hit like three minutes, and it was over, but it, uh, the damage was pretty quick and fast. If you see power lines on the ground, police are advising you not to approach it as it may be live, and if you see traffic lights that are not working, you should treat it as a four-way stop. Reporting in Northeast Wichita, Lily Wu, Cake News.